Thank you. I would like to thank IHG for the opportunity and Stefan. I'm pleased to talk about context and perspective for health information system interoperability in Francophone Africa with you today. Francophone Africa, which includes countries in West Africa, Central Africa, and the Indian Ocean as health system that share certain common characteristics and challenges. However, each country has its own context and specificities. Financing. Resources of healthcare are often limited. In many countries, public funding for healthcare is insufficient to meet the need of the population. Shortage of skilled health workers, particularly in rural areas. To improve financial access to healthcare, several countries have established or are encouraging the establishment of mutual health insurance schemes. There are often significant disparities between uh, urban and rural areas in Francophone Africa countries. Urban centers generally have better access to high quality healthcare, while rural areas can face challenges such as a lack of qualified healthcare professionals. Traditional medicine has an important role to play. Many Africans still rely on traditional healer, herbalists, and other traditional uh, for certain aspects on the healthcare. Institutionally, the healthcare system in Francophone Africa varies from country to country, but many healthcare systems in the region share common characteristics in terms of level of care and governance and are generally structured as follows. Ministry of Health, of Health national agencies and programs, research and planning institutions constitute the central or national level. The regional or provincial level is responsible for health planning, oversight, and resource management. Recording in progress. And Recording province. stopped. District health offices, district hospital constitute the district level. Health centers and clinics, opportunity health workers constitute the peripheral or community level. Several countries in Francophone Africa have a DHS2 health system information. The lead communicates with other system trust bright in the absence of an interoperability framework and the use of common standards by those tools. Telemedicine tools are used in almost all countries with several pilot projects and only a few on a large scale, such as teledermatology in Mali. Recording in progress. Mobile health initiatives to disseminate health information, send vaccination reminders, and provide health advice via SMS, especially in, at the community level, are numerous. Many organizations in Francophone Africa use hospital information system. Some of the solutions are gradually integrated IHE standards, as the case of Sinzan in Mali. The hospital information system Sinzan is working to integrate international standards. Uh, they have been able to integrate LOING, DICOM, ICD-10, and HL-7. One of the challenges of interoperability in Francophone Africa is the heterogeneity of existing system. Disparate no standardized system exists at all levels of the healthcare pyramids in Francophone Africa. Another challenge is the lack of health information system interoperability framework, use and development of tools that do not incorporate common standards and protocols. Gabon is an exception with uh, an interoperability framework based on IHE. There are also uh, technology infrastructure uh, challenge, lack of framework and technical infrastructure on hands-on training and events such as Connectaton. The lack of a clear and robust regulatory framework for healthcare digitization and the need of interoperability. Gabon case is an example of uh, an example of good practice in Francophone Africa. Gabon, which already designed its interoperability framework, 
based on IHE. This is the architecture of Gabon interoperability framework. Three use cases, there are three use cases, intra-hospital components, clinical inter-organization components, and the national supervision components. This is the example of interoperability specification for laboratory in Gabon. Mali also recommended to develop the interoperability framework in his strategic plan. The importance of health information system interoperability in Francophone Africa is increasingly recognized and several initiatives are underway to improve uh, this interoperability. For me, health information system interoperability in Francophone Africa uh, is at a crossroads with prospects that uh, are challenging but promising. Here are some perspectives uh, on the future of health information system interoperability in the region. The public-private partnerships for the technology development combine resources for more effective implementation, private sector technical expertise guaranteed to meet public needs. Education and awareness for healthcare professionals. Training is critical to the understanding, development, elaboration, adoption, and implementation of the interoperability framework. Cooperation between Francophone African countries. Francophone African countries could cooperate more among themselves and with other countries to share best practice and lessons learning. Leverage international standards for interoperability ensure that the solution adopted comply with interoperability standards, facilitate international collaboration with uh, structures such as IHE. In conclusion, interoperability of L information system is not just a technological aspiration. It is an imperative to ensure data sharing for patient care and public health management. Cooperation between IHE and our countries seem more than necessary. In this sense, our team and other uh, sub-regional digital health associations are ready to work with IHE. Thank you for your attention.